pull up to the gate, dude. Who is this in front of us? What's the costume looks like? Golly. I don't know. Get out of the way. All right. Now that he's out of the way, we'll stop. Okay, here's the deal. The 2.4 hours of lay mullets is one month away. Josh here has a goal of selling it out. And what do you get if you sell it out, Josh? <laughs> Dude, that's all I want is satisfaction. I want this place sold out. But also the long awaited event trailer. Oh. oh. <laughs> okay, yes, we're selling this sucker out. So the 2.4 hours of lay mullets did not sell out last year, okay? We, at this point in time, I'll tell you exactly how many tickets we have for sale for the in-person Freedom Factory event tickets. This is how serious we're taking this. Friday night, we still have 3,800 tickets available. That's some VIP, but mostly general admission. Saturday, we have 4,900 tickets available for the 2.4 hours of the mall. It's one month away. And right now we're gonna tell you guys our plan to sell out this event in one month because we we have to sell us out. It's 2.4 hours of the mall. It's last year didn't sell out. That's not cool. We're selling this puppy out. So what we kind of realized is the event got a little stale. It was the same thing for a couple years in a row. And that's why it didn't sell out. Don't know, that's our theory right now. So we have a new devised set of plans to make this happen. So yep, yep. Let's, let's freaking go down here. Freedom. We gotta get down here and get this sorted out. Let's get this sorted out right now. Alright, alright. I'm gonna <laughs> sort it out if we crash the truck. Look at this spot, dude. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, the first method of implementation to spice up our events is we have hired monster trucks. Let's go. Are you talking like a rinky dink truck or are you talking like no, a monster we truck? Serious monster trucks and the drivers already came here to scope it out. And we will be jumping a monster truck off of this hill into the Freedom Factory. That's the night of the Crown Vic race, 2.4 hours of mullets. That's step one. Go ahead. How deep do you want to go? Do you want to just give, give it, it to us? Give all give it. It to Sell us. some tickets. We're talking pyro freaking techniques. Explosions. Explosions. Okay. Big yeah, stuff. Yeah, never yeah. been done before. We've Correct. Never had pyro. All right. So it's going off for the jump, going off for the national anthem, going off during the race, after the race, all over the place. A lot of fireworks. A lot. Dozens of explosions. Yes. Stuff I like people it. like. Explosions. Explosions. Monster <laughs> right. Several monster trucks, but probably the most important part of the show for Friday is this is actually just the back of the track that we've turned into a monster truck jump. So it's about 14 feet high to the wall. What about the fence? We're gonna open the fence up. Taking it down. It's gonna shoot up this hill or we're gonna have some K-rail here on the wall. And then he should be able to jump. Oh and my gosh. Land. Listen, his goal is he clears the asphalt. He wants to land in the grass. That's really he's landing in the dude, grass. Dude, that's how committed we are. The grass is completely <laughs> game to get destroyed for this race. So we have to sell the tickets yeah, to pay for the grass. A lot of hype, big air. Yeah, sure. They, they've seen confident on it. Oh, they're 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 very confident. So then we're hitting cars inside. They're gonna do some donuts. They're gonna rip a couple endos in there. Oh yeah, wheelies. Yeah, it's a whole show. A whole just a monster show. truck show on top of the exactly. Crowd. And they're running a couple times, not just once. All right, so time. giant, giant monster truck jump right there. Yeah, and if I like this. If you do get a VIP ticket, this is the side that you'll be on if you want to visualize. I think there's only a couple hundred VIP tickets. Those always go fast. But back here, we got things spiced up, looking clean. Look at all this paving back here. Yeah, all VIP fresh. Thing. Oh yeah, there'll be like a big tent here. Yep. And that's where they serve the food and all that good stuff. And the Crown Vicks will be right back here in the pits. And yep. the all right, so this is jump two. Yep, this is Saturday. That is way steeper. <laughs> <laughs> Another monster truck jump right this here. This is Bro, the jump. No shot. Look, right here between between the light posts. Oof. It sounds like a perfect idea, right? If you want to sell tickets, <laughs> this I mean, is we, this is yeah, this is risking it for the biscuit right there, hundred percent. We're breaking I mean, all the rules. We're going for the poles. Bro, We're going for the grass. The guy's pointed at the sun when he jumps. Yeah, th this Dude, truck this doesn't even make it up. He's this. confident. Absolutely. <laughs> Look at the angle on that unit. That's his mark. So the plan is he's landing in between those two poles in the grass. Yeah. Okay. Dude, this see this side seems getting... much spicier. Oh yeah. There's some air getting popped. He's gonna run up from just way back there, I guess. No, right where the golf cart is. And they're coming in back to back on Saturday, one after the other. 
Okay. So, that all right. grass is done for. <laughs> Listen, this is Josh's deal, dude. This is what we got to do. Josh's deal. Guys, we need those tickets sold. We need this event trailer. Our event trailer is cranked. It's the only way he's going to let me get one. We need it. Let's do it. Now, let's get to racing and what the actual race is. We're doing things a little different as far as Saturday, but Friday we're doing kidney beam. Right, so we're doing the track layout where you have to go through the infield. I'll show you that real quick. You race this big bank, you bomb down the straightaway. There's the general admission stands right there. Those yeah, will be the sold big. out. <laughs> Gonna be sold out. You know the deal. Then you come around yonder, and instead of going the full track, you got to turn down early here in turn two, which we've already got that skirted out there. And then you got to come across this racing curb right here, back out over this racing curb, and onto the main track. So you guys got that. That's for the 2.4 hours of Wall. It's Friday night. But Saturday, we have our best burnout pad ever. Oh, it is. This okay. is legit. So basically, it's the pad layout we've been doing, except we've uh, we flipped it and set it up different caddy corner. So... This would be the chute coming in. We got that dog leg out to the left, yep. but we kind of threw in this extra little bit where the guys that are really down to take that inner loop. Oh. You can go ahead. Oh, so we're cutting through here. Cutting through there, and you're coming back into the chute. Basically, you get another run out of tipping. I like this downhill tipping. Yep. Yeah, so you line her up right here, hit it, tip in, do your thing, and if you're down for it, you take that inner loop, come right back through again, and you can tip in one more time. So essentially, this is yep. all burnout pad, but this, it has this is open. It has an exit right here. Exactly. So if you want to drift this mid burnout, no stopping on this. Yeah, you got to hang it the whole way out. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh yeah, we Man. also changed the rule. If you back up, you're disqualified. That's a new rule. Yeah. So at this point, now you're back on the pad yeah. again. And then people can stand all around this burnout pad. And then we'll have two big bleachers, mobile bleachers yeah. right here. On that side, all the YouTuber tents and merch booths will be out here. And then you can also, if you want to go sit in those bleachers and watch from up there. So it's a combination of, you can sit there, stand here, sit there, and that's all one ticket. There's no VIP Saturday. Nope, no, it's wide open. And like you mentioned, all this is gonna be filled up with vendors on that backside yeah. there. Um, and that's 4,900 tickets available yeah. for and Saturday. And forgot to mention monster trucks are running that day too. Oh yeah. That's not, So not only do they jump in, but then oh, they're yeah, also- yeah. The they're, big jump is Saturday. Yeah, the bigger jump Saturday, then they also have cars down here, same deal, they're gonna endo, do some donuts. They wanted to make it in the pad, but I told them it's pretty tight. So they may or may not end up in the pad. Okay. But most likely, they'll be out outside the pad. Uh, we don't want to run over those bleachers. No. <laughs> yeah, I want All my right. burnout car. Here's the deal, guys. We got our best event yet. This is going to be a banger. We, we understand why we didn't sell out last year, we think. This year has to sell out. All I can say now is go to the link in the description below, thefoat.com. Get on there. Get your tickets. It's one month from today. Don't say I didn't warn you, okay? Don't say I didn't warn you. One month from today, 2.4 hours of mullets, first ever monster truck show, probably the biggest jump that's ever happened in this track. Plus, we got the Black Rifle, Crown Vic race, 40 drivers. Travis Pastrana and I are gonna win that for sure. And then Saturday, we have our best burnout pad we've ever had. How could you possibly miss it all? So hit up the FOAT. Get your tickets, come here in person. I know I always promote the live stream on baldeagle.com, but I've kind of forgotten about in-person visitors. And I need you guys to come out for this one so we can sell it out. All right, that's it for now. Thanks for watching Do It For Dale. We'll freaking see you later. Josh, hey, any last words, dude? I'm gonna go buy a ticket myself when I work here. That's how jacked up I am. <laughs> I'm going on right now, thefoat.com. I'm buying my ticket. Might even get the VIP. There you go.